yo, what's up? This your boy John o with this week's rant. And with no further delay, I'm going to jump right into it. What actually is the promised land? And who promised us this? Why the fuck does Jason Derulo have a greatest hits album? I reiterate, I love the show Survivor's Remorse. Shout out to my man, Rodrigo Lee. But why is it that the main character, who is a basketball player, is never seen playing basketball? I know this is late, but why the fuck the young jock do that shit to his hair? And does he still have it like that? Should I even talk about the Young Thugs album cover with him? With the dress on? I have nothing to say, man. Nothing at all. To me, bumper stickers are useless. Nigga, Tiana Taylor couldn't get it. Why the fuck is Chris Brown always in trouble? 112 or day 26? You pick it. Nigga, Elder Barge got some smooth ass fucking hair. Man, I really want to see Genuine and Timberland get back together and make some new music. I don't give a fuck what nobody say. There is a such thing. As ugly babies. Nigga, speaking of ugly, all my New York people in the Bronx, they got Bronx 12 News. <laughs> Why the fuck all of the newscasters on there are not pretty? I'm just going to say they're not pretty. I'm not going to say they're ugly. I'm just going to say they're not pretty. <laughs> Is it a prerequisite at Bronx 12 News that you can't be a dime and work on that motherfucking station? Because a lot of the chicks on there, they not pretty. But speaking of pretty newscasters, Shirlene Ellicott on ABC 7 News in New York? She might be my new baby mama in my head. She fine. Oh yeah. She fine. And finally, I know this is a short week because uh, I've been away a while. I know I always say that, but... I promise you, I'm back in full effect. <laughs> I'm back in full effect. But finally, I want to address uh, a little situation that happened probably a couple weeks ago with Pete Rock and uh, I forgot the dude's name. Um, see, that's how unimportant the dude is. But anyway, Pete Rock got into this issue with some cat on Instagram because Pete Rock decided to say that dude's trash. Um, um, he... Whoever the guy was, man, I can't remember his name. He was doing his uh, album release on a porch. And one of his songs was talking about how he had cocaine in his veins and a whole bunch of negative stuff. And then there was a little kid right there on the porch. So I guess the dude posted it and Pete Rock seen it and said, you know, something to the effect of this is why hip hop is whack today and blah, blah, blah. And um, I just want to say this. I'm a big, huge Pete Rock fan, so I'm all in support of whatever Pete Rock said. Um, not dick rotten, but just being real about the situation. Why would you uh, promote some negative stuff like that when you got a little kid right there listening to that trash? Not to mention that, and I don't remember, man, I wish I, you tell me the guy's name. Anyway, um, um, not to mention that I've never listened to the dude like that. Um, so I can't really make a judgment on his music But 9 times out of 10 A lot of the cast that's coming out today To me are trash anyway Then P-Rock got back on IG And he dissed Little Yachty <clears throat> Now, I will say this I have listened to some of Little Yachty stuff And he is straight garbage Him, Little Uzi, Little Yachty Little whoever the fuck um, I fucks with Little Dicky shout, shout out to Little Dicky But back to Little Yachty And Little Uzi Vert and all of them to me, them niggas are garbage. Um, I know by now all y'all seen the freestyle that, uh, well, actually, both of the videos that have been floating around of them freestyling up at Hot 97 were both trash. Again, I'd have to ask why were they up there. Some people say they did it just to prove to people that them dudes are garbage, which could be true because Ebro did son, um, son them both, actually. Um, but I will say this, man. I, I don't want this to be confused as hate for the new school cats that's out doing their thing right now. But there is a lot of garbage ass music and a lot of these cats are not even rhyming. They're mumble rappers. Like that's the term that people call them today. And a lot of times us as the older generation gets a, a, the bad rap of because we don't like something we're considered haters and that's not even the case um what's dope is dope and what's whack is whack 
it is okay for you to have an opinion. I have a strong opinion about today's hip hop, and it is what it is. A lot of the dudes today, the majority of them, are very uh, trash. Bottom line, they're just trash. Um, you can't understand what they're saying. There's no motherfucking originality. Everybody is rhyming the same. With the exception of a few, and you don't know who they are, um, that are good. Um, the majority of the hip-hop game is garbage. Um, and I, I, I just feel that as a legend, like Pete Rock, not myself, he has a right to say something. If he feels that somebody is garbage, why not express that? Don't take it personal. Step your motherfucking game up. It's just that simple. If people are calling you trash, go back and put some time behind that pen and pad, like Buster said, and kick some shit. Don't get mad because a legend is fucking calling you out. They can just step your game up, man. And then niggas won't talk about you. Or they will talk about you in a good way. And this has been this week's rant with your boy John O. Make sure you don't do something, say something. Let me see something to end your ass up on this list. Shout out to all my four horsemen. You know who you are. Um, David Rubinson for always coming with the dope things. I see your questions, man. I'm going to get to them. I promise. I promise. They don't go unnoticed. To my man Jay Mugger, uh, Jay Hernandez, uh, music lover, all of the cats that always continue to support. Please keep doing that, man. I love y'all cats, man. And keep the, uh, the ideas coming, man. Um, check out the new video, uh, tonight is the name of the song, Harlem to Houston, um, that is up now, um, definitely peep the new episode of John the Father on AVN Crockett's channel, um, what else do I got to promote, make sure you download the single tonight, the link is in the description box, and continue to support, man, with that being said, don't be smart, be genius, and always, 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 stay gecko, I'll see y'all next time, man. Hey, what's up, guys? If you enjoyed that video, then I need you to subscribe. And you can always stay updated on all my new videos by following me on Facebook.com forward slash John Ali. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you soon. Kate told me to do this. Hey guys, I'm Kate, and I'm the one that told him to do this. Aren't you glad?